Now we're taking a look at the uh, Hayes Bald Eagle Nest. Oh my goodness, mom or dad hanging out with the babes this morning. I don't know, they looking like they got some wet feathers this morning, what do you, you know, think? It's a Monday for all of us. Yeah. It's a Monday for them too. <laughs> yeah. All right, Ron. I, I don't think that they know it's a Monday. I, I'm just True. throwing that out there. Good point. <laughs> you don't know that. <laughs> they might know. Yes. <laughs> they're, they're on our calendar as well. The Gregorian calendar. Yeah, let's uh, talk about your forecast and what's going on. Uh, with the uh, rain showers moving in at this point, we're going to continue to see this rain chance over the course of the day today. Unlike uh, over the weekend where we saw some big gaps in the rain, at least right now, it looks like we're going to be fairly continuous with rain as this upper low continues to be anchored right on top of the western uh, Lake Erie at this time. So high temperatures today. We probably have already hit them right at 44 degrees. We'll be hovering around there for the afternoon hours. Yeah, you can see it right there overnight tonight. Snow chances on the rise mixed with rain showers 37, at least if you're in Pittsburgh for the overnight low. I do want to start you off with not only our temperatures for the day, but I want to really show you our wind chills because our wind speeds are going to be pretty high. We're already seeing them gusting to the 20s. We'll be looking at wind speeds at around 15 miles an hour for the rest of the day. It's going to be pretty nasty out there. So even with us into the uh, 40s this afternoon, our wind chills are just just expected to get back into the mid 30s today. So rain showers will be around. I'm going to move you all the way up until 8 o'clock tonight. We're seeing some rain showers continuing at that point. That changes over by midnight to a mix of rain and snow sliding in again from the west. This is going to last some time. In fact, we're going to be waking up tomorrow morning with a lot of snow showing up on radar. It's going to be a mix in places like Allegheny County to the south. Uh, Long I-70, but places like the Laurel Highlands, the uh, snow belt of Armstrong, Indiana County, and up along I-80, it should be a lot of snow coming in, and I am expecting very briefly some snow to be on the ground before it melts away. We'll change back over to some rain heading into the afternoon on Tuesday. So rain chances and snow chances both today and tomorrow. Our rain drizzle chances start to go down from there. I'm even going to continue with a 20% chance uh, for some ice, like very light rain as we're waking up on Saturday morning. Hey, currently right now it's 39 outside. Notice that wind chill. It's all the way down to 31 and look at our winds out of the southwest at 13 miles an hour. We're gusting up to 21 miles an hour at this time. Temperatures are going to be hovering around 40 degrees. Number of places starting off though in the 30s, including 38 in Zelianople, Butler 38, containing 40, and the new 7 o'clock temperature in Pittsburgh just coming in, showing 39 degrees at this time. Here's your 7-day 40. I'm being pretty aggressive, keeping those temperatures down on Tuesday as the upper low continues to move by. 44 year Wednesday high, so very cool as we're starting off the month of May. Thursday high of 56 degrees, but notice our morning lows are still in the 30s through Friday, and then we start to warm up. 62 year Friday high, 69 on Saturday, sunny and 73 the high on Sunday.